Hey Divine, how are you guys doing today? I hope your spirits find you well. Thank you for joining me on this transformational journey. My name is KB. And today I just wanted to lighten things up a little bit and have a little fun with some cards. So as you guys know, I've been doing this for about four years now and um, I love doing readings. Absolutely love them. I enjoy them. There's a uh, there is a process that I go through um, in which I connect with spirit and I'm able to deliver a message to you. But today I just wanted to play around with pick a card. So I'm going to show you some cards. I want you to focus whatever resonates with you. That is the card that you need to pick. OK, here we go. This is card one. This is card two. This is card three. And I have one bonus card at the end of this. I'll show you that one. All right. So the ones that pick card one. Beautiful card, right? A beautiful card. This is the card to finances or an opportunity that you've been waiting for is about to come to fruition. So be mindful of that, okay? Be mindful that there's something that you've been wanting. Not It doesn't necessarily have to be funds, but it's an opportunity that is going to present itself that was in your subconscious that you've been wanting. And the pathway and the energy is now available for you to receive it. So be on the lookout for that, okay? And it could be the smallest thing or the biggest thing, but just make sure you are grateful when you do receive it all right those the pick number two you are the magician now this one is just like what they're trying to tell you is that the power is within right we all have these different capabilities and different powers all of us are not the same but when it comes to your powers and capabilities they are different a group of people have this skill a group of people have this skill a group of people have this skill so just know that you are the magician and if there's something that is difficult in your life you need to understand how to go about figuring it out to resolve that issue by using your magistical powers to gain understanding and making whatever you desire to come to fruition so that's what they're trying to let you know that situations don't have to be stuck. You don't have to be stuck in a particular situation. Because you have capabilities, you need to figure out what they are, utilize them for the situation that you're in so you can get out of it, okay? But know that you are very magistical, you're very magical. Figure out what your gifts are, use them towards the situation that you're in right now, and get out of that situation. All right? All right. Number three, now this could be one or two things, right? Either you're in a relationship that is not beneficial for your highest good and you need to think about terminating it, or it could be your emotions. Your emotions, you're not able to deal with the emotions that, that you're going through right now. So what you probably need to do is go within and figure out how to eliminate the emotions that you're dealing with. You have to deal with them instead of suppress them. And this is all about suppressing your emotions. These are some emotions that are really tough, that are really hard and strong. They're masculine emotions and you, you don't know what to do with them, but you're going to have to figure it out one way or another on how to work on these emotions. On the other hand, like I mentioned before, is a relationship, a male in your life, or it could be a female, but particularly a male in your life that means you no good, that does you no good, does you no justice. They're deceitful. They're angry. They're, they're not for your highest good. Like I said before, get rid of them. That's all I have to say. Get rid of them. R relations like ship like this, if you're on the journey or on the path that I'm on, there's no time to waste. Let them go. 
Now for everybody, this is what I wanted to show you. This is the abundance card. So this card says you are just starting. You are just getting started. So have patience with yourself and the process and do not give up. This is a perfect card for everybody that is on their spiritual path, for everybody that is on their spiritual journey. This card is so important. You're on this path. Have patience with yourself. Never give up. On this journey, we always are. This is a tough journey to be on, right? This is a tough journey for the initiates. Tough journey to be on, but a blissful journey to be on because it is so rewarding. But have patience with yourself. Don't be so hard on yourself. You're going to make it. Just never give up. Never. All right? I love you guys. Thanks for watching and have a blissful day.